enjoying the ride, Billbug? I sure am, Bosley. <laughs> what a great morning. Race you home, Dad? First to the courtyard wins. You're on. Someone's stuffy fell in the mud. All washed up and ready for lunch. Ta da! <laughs> I'll get ready too. Time for lunch, Pillbug. <gasps> Pillbug! See, Bosley? Tea party fun, fun, fun. <sighs> I really miss Pillbug. You can hold sprinkles. Me heard crying me. Bosley sad about lost Pillbug? When me sad, me cuddle special polka dot blanket. You want to try you? Blanket is cozy. Thank you. We can't replace Pillbug, but if he's really gone, we can at least give Bosley something special to cuddle. Ta-da! I know it's not the same as Pillbug, but maybe it'll help. Let's get it to him fuzzly fast. Wait a minute. I bet Bosley's pill bug flew off the bike just like this one. But if it's not here now, someone else must have taken it. And the new stuffy we made him is all muddy and yucky. Did you find pill bug? We tried, but I think he's gone. We made you this to help you feel better. I'm so sorry, Bosley. Abby, Mo, and Bo made this for Bosley? Everyone works so hard to make Bosley happy. Bosley have best friends in the world. Thank you. Hugs. Aww. Bosley and Melvin. You just sit right here. Now let's see. Owie. Aha, an owie leg. I have just the thing. A little snap-on cast. There. The Fuzzly Spotter. Spotted! There's trouble in the salon with Harriet! Fuzzly trouble! Can't delay! To the rescue, save the day! Owie! You should stay off your leg if you're hurt, but Abby needs sidekick to help! Abby needs a sidekick to help? Hmm. You need to stay off that leg. Abby! Did I hear you need a sidekick? Wow! I can barely tell you two apart! It's like looking in the mirror. Why Melvin dressed like Bosley? So I can be Abby's sidekick. You do need one today, right? Actually, since Bosley's hurt, I do need a sidekick. Yeah! Woohoo! Come on, Melvin. Blimp jacket, activate! I knew you would come. I just have to get you over to Melvin's cushion. Uh. Perfect, Melvin. Right there. Ready, Harriet? Uh-huh. Whee! <laughs> I did it! I did it! Great job, Melvin. Abby and the missing Binky. Abby? Bosley, are you here? I'm Kitty sitting Elvin. And I wanted to borrow something we can play with. Huh, they're not here. Oh, here's something we can play with. I'll bring it right back when I'm done kitty sitting Elvin. Binky! Binky! What happened, Peepers? Where's her Binky? Heat vision specs activate. Footprints. A feather and teeny footprints. It has to be Teeny Terry. To the roof deck, Bosley. <laughs> you like the pill bug, huh? Pill bug favorite, not for Kitty. <gasps> Binky gone. Heat vision specs activate. Rubber baby Binky bounces. The Binky went over the roof. The bounce marks lead in here. Chef Jeff, have you seen Little Doe's Binky? No, but it looks like she found it. Oh, oh no, that's a mushroom. I made the same mistake. <laughs> this mushroom does look like Little Doe's Binky. I bet the Binky bounced onto one of the pizzas. Let's find it. 
Excuse me. Nope. Pardon me. Excuse me. There must be something I missed. Zoom review glasses, activate. Bosley, did you put that pizza in your pouch? Yep, mushroom Bosley's favorite. The only slices of pizza we didn't check are in your pouch. Hmm. Ta-da! The pinky! We did it! Blizzacular! Abby meets her first Fuzzly. Welcome to the Hatcher Palace Hotel, Abby. Ta-da! We know you'll love living here. I hope so. Hey, remember this? My old blankie. <sighs> Soft and snuggly like a fuzzly. <gasps> Do you think there are any fuzzlies here? <laughs> huh? Your dad and I need to get the hotel ready for guests. Why don't you explore? Maybe you'll find a fuzzly friend. Friend? This is my room? Cool! <gasps> Fuzzly cookies! You're the best, Mom! <gasps> I heard that! There is a Fuzzly here! <gasps> you like cookies? Hey, wait! Are you a Fuzzly? Maybe. Would you like another cookie? <laughs> My name is Abby Hatcher. Do you have a name? Me, Bosley. Nice to meet you, Bosley. Can I tell you a secret? <laughs> I've wanted a Fuzzly best friend my whole life. But I've never actually talked to one before. I'm kind of nervous. Me nervous, too. You know what always makes me feel better when I'm afraid of something new? It's my blanket. I've had it since I was a baby. Would you like to have it? <gasps> Eww! <laughs> gotcha! Cut me! Will you be my friend? Best friend! Abby and Bosley babysit Lara. <laughs> she really does love you. I don't suppose hotel greeters babysit, do they? We could unpack a lot faster if Lara was with you and Abby. Lara with Bozzy. Abby and Bosley can babysit. A happy guest. That's what's best. That's our motto. You two are the best hotel greeters ever. Come on, I'll take you to your room. <laughs> Are you sure you want to babysit? Whoa! A happy guest? That's what's best. Laura happy with us. Laura happy? Boss, the ears not happy. What now? We need to keep her busy with a game. But what? Phew. Just finished the last check-in of the day. How are you two doing with little Laura? Actually, we have a problem. We know a happy guest, that's what's best. Blank, blank, blank. Laura blank. keeps playing with Bosley's ears, and he doesn't like it. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I did say a happy guest is best, but that doesn't mean you have to let them do something you don't like, Bosley. Really? Absolutely. If you don't like what someone is doing, say please stop. If they don't stop, ask a grown-up like me for help. Now that we know we can speak up, maybe we can play with Lara in a better way. Yeah, Bosley wanna try. Bosley! No ears, Lara, okay? Bosley doesn't like it. You can't touch anyone unless you ask first. And they say it's okay. Okay, hug, Bosley. Yes, Bosley loves hugs. <laughs> Love you. Oh, Love you too. Play now? Sure, balloon toss. <laughs> <laughs> now that's a great way to play. Well done. Room for two more. Zoom! All right. Abby babysits Mumbles. Ah. Aw, baby Mumbles tired from bouncing. Grumble's tired too. Baby's sitting hard. Bosley and I can watch Mumbles for you. Really? Sure. I know all the rules for babysitting baby Fuzzlies. Fuzzly fact. One, never get a tired baby Fuzzly overexcited. Two, never feed a baby Fuzzly after dark. Three, never wake a sleeping baby Fuzzly. Abby does no rules. Uh, 
Uh. Grandma's nap now. Bye! What do you think, Mumbles? Is it your nap time too? Uh. <laughs> oh. Mumbles sounds tired. He sure doesn't look tired. <laughs> we need to wear him out. Hmm. Baby seems really tired and excited. <laughs> We started with one Mumbles, and now there's two! Yay! <laughs> What's this? Would you like some milk and cookies? <laughs> Shut down! Ah! Wait! <laughs> no! It's dark outside, and rule number two says... Never, never feed baby, baby Fuzzlies after dark! <laughs> I see you, baby Mumbles. Pogo Spring Shoes, activate. <laughs> we need to get those other babies. Got a toy, Bosley? Toy! <laughs> Yoo-hoo, babies! <laughs> Aw, so sweet. No drool on Pillbug, please. <sighs> Looks like these babies are ready for bed. Let's get them upstairs. <laughs> Stop copying me! Follow, 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 follow. Follow, 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 follow. We're playing follow the leader, so stretch a tall like me. We'll do the same as you do. Easy as one, two, three. <laughs> we can't stretch like you and Mo, so we'll walk on our tippy toes. <laughs> Princess Plug, come play follow the leader with us. Can't, Abby. Me planting pretty flowers, me. Now make a circle. Go really fast. <laughs> Bosley can do it with roller skates. Whoa! Yee! Now Bosley makes circle like Mo and Mo. Whoa! <laughs> Come on. 
on, Bosley. I have the most spectacular idea ever. <gasps> Real life snakes and ladders game. Woo! Yeah. Yay! Most favorite game. Come on. Yeah. Real life play is way more fun, and we can play with everyone. The lost button trail. If we keep going this way, we'll get to the big hill. Yay! What's very big? How do we not get lost? Got the fuzzly craft case? Uh-huh. Ta-da! We'll just use sewing buttons. We can use them to make a trail in the snow. See? If we keep dropping buttons, we can follow the trail back home. Yay! Yay! <gasps> Run ahead! Can't wait to ride our sled! <gasps> Whoa!
bow. With a little help from the Fuzzly Craft Case. Yay! That was close. <laughs> <laughs> Mo missed Bo so. Bo missed Mo so too. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks, Abby. Missing Mo and Bo. Yay! Yay! And how does it go? Mo wants to ride. Push the button on the side. Yeah! yeah. Awesome! awesome. Faster, horsey, let's be Bo. Bo will win. Mo's horse is slow. <laughs> no Mo and Bo. Where'd they go? I'm not sure. My fuzzly alarm is quiet, so they're not in trouble. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we should probably get you back to your friend Abby. This way! <laughs> no Mo and Bo. Now where'd they go? Zoom review specs activate! <laughs> I see their fur, so they were definitely here. <gasps> balloons! <laughs> I could play with balloons all day. <gasps> oh no, Mo, we're floating away! Oh no! I'll save you! Sophie, hold on! Whoa. Mo and Bo are in trouble again. Yeah, right there! <laughs> Quick, to the bike! For sky wings, activate. I'll get Mo and Bo. You can help the girl. Fozzy Flyers, activate. Woohoo! Jump, little girl. I'll catch you. Yay! Abby! Floaty, dip, floaty. Bo, catch the floaty. Hang on, we're going down. Yay! Indeed it does. I have fresh smelling pink lemonade. Uh, what's that? <laughs> it's terrible. Where's the smell coming from? Bosley, find out. Ah, uh, yeah. big smell here. Hi, say hi, Sprinkles. Hi. My dear assistant chef, I think we need to put Sprinkles somewhere else. Sprinkles, stay! <laughs> Sprinkles hug, too. Ugh. Ugh. <coughs> if we made Sprinkles smell beautiful, could she stay? If she smelled beautiful? Of course! How Sprinkles smell beautiful, Abby? I don't know, but I do know we have two experts on what's beautiful right here in this hotel. Come on, Bosley and Curly, to the salon! We are experts at all things beautiful. Like perfume. Watch. <laughs> uh oh, Sprinkles, no good. She just kind of still smells like feet. Hmm. When my socks are dirty, my mom washes them and makes them smell great. I bet that'll really get rid of the smell. To the bath. <laughs> Okie dokie, Curly. Bath. Time for sprinkles. Sprinkles. Party to prepare. I still have to mash the potatoes and frost the cake. Ugh, I'll never have enough time. Curly, help. Curly, mash. <laughs> I can't be distracted by flying potatoes. Curly, please go with Abby and Bosley. Curly, 
go? Yeah, it'll be fun. Come on, Charlie. Okay. <sighs> Chef Jeff's can't resist cake.
darkness, you're safe. But we sleep over. <laughs> Can't sleep with these hiccups. Might as well get some work done. <laughs>
we can help. Hmm. <gasps> Rainbow! We can make Abby her own snark. Come on. Hatcher Palace Hotel. 
I'm going to show you the most fuzz-tastic hotel you've ever seen. Hmm. Our elevator operator, Otis, makes getting around the hotel truly magical. Watch it. All fine, but truly, we've seen enough. No, you haven't. Don't give up on us. There's so much more to see. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Bomber blimp jacket. This is all unacceptable. Come on, Frankie, let's go. Wait, please don't leave yet. Mr. Cameraman, can I help you put the hotel video together? I think you might have missed some really amazing things. Fine, but please hurry. Fantastic! Wait till you see what she helped me put together. Action. This video is perfection, and so is the Hatcher Palace Hotel. Whoa. Abby's Glizacular Christmas. Everyone ready for more jolly jingles? What is it? What's wrong? There's a big snowstorm blowing in. We had to cancel the Christmas party. Cancel? Cancel? <sighs> 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 friends can't come to the hotel Christmas party, then we'll bring the hotel Christmas party to them. Yeah! We may not have Santa's sleigh and flying reindeer, but we've got a grumble sleigh and flying fuzzlies. Yeah! 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 Hmm. Need one more thing. Yes! You are so ho-ho prepared. Light it up! Mo and Bo have Christmas glow. Then away we go. Your ears go! On Bosley, on Peepers, on Mo, on Bo! Traditions, and we can get home in time for Santa. Yay! Yay! Hurry, everybody! It's Christmas morning! Yay! 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 Came. Santa came! Yay! Wow! Oh my gosh, Look I what love I got. this! Cool! Ding, ding, ding! You love presents, me! Cool! Merry Christmas, Abby. We love you. I love you, too. I love all of you, and I love celebrating Christmas together. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, Daddy! Chinese New Year! Happy Chinese New Year! Uh-oh. <laughs> you made meatballs! Waipo loves your meatballs. Meatballs for Grandma! It'd be so great if she could spend Chinese New Year with us. Waipo is joining us for Chinese New Year. She's on a plane and she'll be here by sundown. Huh? What? <gasps> that is spectacular! You know what this means, Bosley? Uh, big hugs from Grandma? Yes. And it means we get to make the perfect Chinese New Year celebration for her. Come on! <gasps> Off we go! <laughs> So sorry. It's not your fault, Grumbles. It was an accident. What we do, Abby? I don't know. Without a dragon dance, it won't even feel like a Chinese New Year celebration. Abby! Fuzzies! <gasps> oh, this room is beautiful. Oh dear. Was that a dragon costume? It was, but we messed up and wrecked it. I'm sorry we can't give you the perfect Chinese New Year celebration, Waipo. If you want a dragon dance, I bet you can figure out how to do one. Can you help? Of course! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, I can't wait! 
Me neither. Welcome, welcome to my po. We love you so much, you know. Thanks for giving us the chance to try Chinese Venus Dragon Dance. Amazing, Avi! This is the most incredible Chinese New Year ever! Thank you, Ipo. The secret passageway. <laughs> Peepers never find Uncle here. <laughs> one it is. Let's see. I've got the key to the back door, a uh, key to storage, key to the freezer in the basement. Abby, taking too long. Don't worry, Otis. I have another plan. Hi, Teeny Terry. Hi, Abby. We need your help. If you've got a jam, I'll make it scram. Thanks, Teeny Terry. Bosley, do you have your extendo hand? Oh! Aha! Extendo hand! Can you make this extendo hand come down from the top of the machine? Then we can use it to pull Otis free. Sure. I'm ready to build. Watch this. Ta-da! Here you go, Abby. Thanks, Teeny Terry. Downstairs. To the lobby! Gotcha! Huh? Right, what? Weird. There's no one here. Uh oh! <gasps> Wait! Uh -oh. Bye -bye. Who was that? But the mailman? <gasps> the Fuzzly Spotter! Fuzzly Trouble Camp Delay! To the rescue! Save the day! Press, 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 press! Bosley, keep 
an eye out for the fuzzly. Ooh, there! Ooh, more buttons! Oh. Bye-bye! Fuzzly just wants to ding! And play with lights. And vacuum. Da -da 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 -da. Hooray! Fuzzly, that's it! All those things, the bell, the light, the vacuum. Oh! Fuzzly like buttons? Yes! The elevator! Open! Hey, little guy. I know you like buttons. Buttons! <laughs> Brain spark! Bosley, do you still have that hat? <gasps> Ta-da! Ding! Elevator! Operator Otis! <gasps> buttons! Bosley, quick! Something with lots of buttons! <laughs> okay! Ta-da! Accordion! Yes! An accordion has lots of buttons. Here you go, Otis. <laughs> buttons! New elevator operator. Here you go. Otis sad. Want to play with Pillbug? Sure. Probably her tentacles mean Otis can't do anything. What if Otis uses your extendo hand to grab the Pillbug? Yeah! Extendo hand! It works! Doesn't hurt! Now Otis can cuddle a pill bug! Aha! The elevator is free! Here, you help me with these. Princess Bug, I need a big favor. Can you run the elevator for a while? It's easy. Just make sure you're the only one who touches the buttons. Happy to help, Abby. Thanks so much. <laughs> Welcome to elevator. Oh, buttons.
treat. You all look so cute. Now get together and say trick or treat. Trick or treat. Woof woof. Woof. I see you take your costume very seriously. <laughs> Let's go trick or treating. Oh. Have fun and stay together. We'll be home by dark and we'll all stick together. Now let me show you how to trick or treat. Come on! Yeah. Yeah. Is everyone ready for the next house? Yes! yes. Otis didn't woof. Otis? Where, Where Otis? Otis? Where'd Otis go? Where'd he go? Where? But he has to be here. I know. I'll check the fuzzly spotter. <laughs> Fuzz Black. He's too far away. Otis? No, Otis, he is not there. Otis! Otis! It's just about time to go back in. Look, it's almost dark. It is almost dark. Hmm. Maybe Otis could see us with a signal. Great spark! That's how we'll get Otis back. We'll make sure he sees us in the dark. Bubbles, Princess Plug. Bomber Blimp Jack. Look out! 
accident. And I love you a lot more than I love that bike. We know you made a mistake with the bike, but you said you were sorry, so... Ta-da! Scooter! <gasps> Otis rides Scooter! Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Go, Otis, go! Princess Plug helps out. <laughs> I think we got more jelly on our faces than our toast. Me? Clean face me. Ta-da! Flugtastic! I wish I could wash away the sticky jelly with bubbles. I know! Ta-da! <laughs> Kinda works. Nope, gotta wash my face. Race you to the sink! <laughs> Dad? Teeny Terry? What happened? We were trying to build a knick-knack shelf, but we messed it up. And now if either of us moves... <laughs> the whole thing will fall apart. Oh! Knick-knack shelf not stick together, knick-knack shelf. You're right. But you can make it stick with your glitter glue. Me glitter glue me. On three, you move out and Princess Flood glues. One, two, three! Whoa! Yay! Yay! Great job, Princess Flug! Yay! You saved the day! Thanks for helping, Princess Flug. You're the best. Cousin Flotilda! Fuzzly cousin? Yep, and her friends are my friends. Hi, your friend. <laughs> Aww. <gasps> Look, tea party, Flug Tilda. Tea party. First, me need big entrance. Huh? <laughs> Everyone sing with me. Flug Tilda, me. Yeah! Us conga, us sing. Us conga, us sing. No friends, me. New, new home, me. <laughs> Help me! Huh? Princess Flug's suitcase is gone, and she left a note. Everyone loves Flug Tilda. Me leave forever, me? <gasps> this is terrible. The Fuzzly Spotter. <gasps> Princess Flug's in trouble. To the park. <clears throat> Princess Flug. Hang on. I'm coming. Bomber Blimp's jacket activate. Trouble. The most important rose arranging contest of the year is happening here, today. But I can't enter without any roses. Without any roses for Rosa Palooza, you say? Oh, we have roses. There's one right here. Beautiful. Smell. <laughs> oh. Abby, glitter goo. Oh, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about, Judge Thorne. Uh, why don't you come in for some tea? <sighs> A cup of tea would be nice, as would a napkin. Thank you. Psst. Let me know if you find the roses. Okay, Bosley. We know there's a Fuzzly around here somewhere. Oh. But where? Ah. Huh? Oh! Look! A glitter glue trail! Let's follow it! Me, Princess Flug, me! Hello, Princess Flug. So, you took all those roses to help the hotel win the Rosa Palooza contest. Yes, us win. Us. That's spectacular. 
But you still shouldn't have taken things without asking. Me sorry, me. Let the Rosa Palooza commence! <gasps> Contest starting, Abby. <laughs> oh, no! Wait! <laughs> Ta-da! Judge Thorne, this is our hotel's entry. Everyone helped. <gasps> Why, that's beautiful. By the flower power vested in me, I declare this hotel the winner of the Rosa Palooza contest. New elevator operator. Here you go. How just sad. Want to play with Pillbug? Sure. Ouchie, her tentacles mean Otis can't do anything. What if Otis uses your extendo hand to grab the Pillbug? Yeah! Extendo hand! Ooh. It works! Doesn't hurt! Now Otis can cuddle Pillbug! Aha! The elevator's free. Here, you help me with these. Princess Bug, I need a big favor. Can you run the elevator for a while? It's easy. Just make sure you're the only one who touches the buttons. Happy to help, Abby. Thanks so much. <laughs> Welcome to elevator. Oh, buttons. Stop! Abby said only me press buttons, me. Trouble. Oh, just come too. What about your boo boos? Oh, just have extendo hands. Help! What do we do, Abby? Oh, just know what to do. For sure, red buttons at the same time. We can do this. Let's go, Bosley. Ooh. Sparkle Goose Splash Pool, perfect place to make pretty things. Done. 
This jungle gym is the perfect place to run around and climb. I'm going to try it out. Awesome! Yeah! Careful, Bosley. We don't want sparkle goo. Bubbles. Oops. Shoes, activate! Huh? Abby? Bosley? Are you okay? <laughs> We're okay! The sparkle goo in Jungle Gym bars made a tower fort! Walls in here are so shiny and sparkly! It's your fault, this! You should have built what I wanted! Places to make pretty things. Why couldn't you build what I wanted? Places to run around and climb. Now Abby and Bosley are trapped. Not trapped anymore! Yay! You have to come see this place. It's fantastic. Come on! Yeah! yeah. So pretty! So pretty! And look at all the places to climb around! Presents for Abby so you can make her birthday super special? Yes! Yeah. Yes! Yay! Yeah. 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 Night show accordion, best gift for Abby! Ding! Abby will love, love, love cooling chef's hat to cool her down when she gets hot. See? But our musical tap shoes play their own song. She can tap along. <laughs> I got her rocket boots so she can fly to the rescue. <gasps> oh, no! That's the old switch! Ah! 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 Phew, but... Abby! Where is everybody? Help! Help! Bomber Blimp Jacket, activate! Copter ears, go! Really sticky. We know what to do. <laughs> I'm glad you're all okay. I guess I'll get back to my pancakes now. And I'll let you, Fuzzlies, get back to whatever birthday surprise you were planning. <laughs> what happened? How'd you get stuck? Our presence for Abby led to trouble. Hmm. Oh, Fuzzly, no. It's a combination of our ideas. Rocket-powered tap boots and a musical light show cooling hat. Fantastic! <laughs> Phew! All that dancing and flying made me hot. Ah. This is the best birthday present ever. Thank you so much. Abby and the Missing Binky. Are you here? I'm Kitty Sitting Elvin, and I wanted to borrow something we can play with. Huh, they're not here. Oh, here's something we can play with. I'll bring it right back when I'm done Kitty Sitting Elvin. Binky, Binky! What happened, Peepers? Where's her Binky? Heat vision specs activate. Footprints. A feather and teeny footprints. It has to be Teeny Terry. To the roof deck, Bosley. <laughs> you like the pill bark, huh? <laughs> pill bug favorite, not for Kitty. <gasps> Binky gone! Heat vision specs activate. Rubber baby Binky bouncing. The Binky went over the roof. The bounce mark's laid in here. Chef Jeff, have you seen Little Doe's Binky? No, but it looks like she found it. Oh, oh no, that's a mushroom. I made the same mistake. <laughs> this mushroom does look like Little Doe's Binky. I bet the Binky bounced onto one of the pizzas. Let's find it. Excuse me. Nope. Pardon me. Excuse me. There must be something I missed. Zoom review glasses. Bosley, did you put that pizza in your 
pouch? Yep, Mushroom Bosley's favorite. The only slices of pizza we didn't check are in your pouch. Mm. Ta-da! The Binky! We did it! Blizzacular! Abby and Elvin. <gasps> Elvin, you're wrecking your kitty castle. Hi, Melvin. What's with all the stuff? I'm trying to build Elvin a kitty castle, but he keeps knocking everything around. <laughs> Maybe Bosley and I can help. If we kitty sit Elvin, you'll be able to finish the kitty castle. That'd be so cool. Have fun making the kitty castle. Yeah! yeah. Okay, Elvin. You play with us while Melvin works on your kitty castle. <gasps> Kitty on the run! <gasps> Elvin! Elvin! This kitty castle's gonna be so cool! I can't wait for Elvin to play in it! Get us down there, Bosley! Copter ears, go! Woohoo! Hard. Bosley and I can watch Mumbles for you. Really? Sure. I know all the rules for babysitting Baby Fuzzly. Fuzzly fact. One, never get a tired Baby Fuzzly overexcited. Two, never feed a Baby Fuzzly after dark. Three, never wake a sleeping Baby Fuzzly. Abby does know rules. Uh, Grandma's nap now. Bye. What do you think, Mumbles? Is it your nap time too? <laughs> oh, Mumble sounds tired. He sure doesn't look tired. <laughs> we need to wear him out. Hmm. Baby seems really tired and excited. <laughs> <gasps> we started with one Mumbles, and now there's two. Yay! <laughs> What's this? Would you like some milk and cookies? <laughs> Shut down! Ah! Two says, never, never feed, feed baby, baby Fuzzlies after dark! <laughs> <laughs> after those babies, Fuzzlies! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> I see you, baby Mumbles! Pogo Spring Shoes, activate! <laughs> we need to get those other babies. Got a toy, Bosley? Toy! <laughs> <laughs> Jewel on Pillbug, please. <sighs> Looks like these babies are ready for bed. Let's get them upstairs. <laughs> Fuzzly costume ball. You look so cute as a peeper. Almost time for Abby's big entrance. Me so excited, me. <laughs> Look out! We've got to gear up and help. Follow me. Whoa. 
Abby. Oh, my costume. Maybe we can make one more? There's no time. Maybe I should just skip the costume ball. <sighs> Poor Abby. I'd give her the costume off my back if she wanted it. Costume off our backs. Ooh, brain spark! I know how we'll get Abby back. Listen. Abby, we have a surprise for you. Surprise? For me? Close your eyes, close! Okay, if you say so. Ta-da! <gasps> it's beautiful! I've never seen a costume like it. Everyone wants Abby at the party. Everyone! That's the most spectacular thing anyone's ever done for me. I love it. So will you come back to the costume ball? Are you kidding? I wouldn't miss it for anything. Thank you so much. Abby's lost glasses. Bosley coming down field! Ready to score! Won't get past me! I got it! Whoa! Oh! Abby, you okay? Yeah, I'm... Huh? Bosley? Abby? Bosley here. <laughs> Sorry. Can't see super well without my glasses. Help me find them. Glasses finder, activate! Detective Bosley on the case! Hmm. Huh? I think I'm back at the playground. I don't remember this balance beam. Whoa! Abby! We have your glasses! You do? I can fix it. 
but it's gonna take a while. Does it have to? We really want to get back to our water balloon game. I guess I could save the forever fix for later and just do a quick fix for now. It's really not the best idea, but... It's a splizacular idea. Go for it. Here comes the Super Splat Master. <laughs> the Fuzzly Spotter? Passageways flooded! Now Peeper's washing away! We've got to save him! Abby, there's a problem with the pipes in the kitchen! <laughs> Please help! On it! We'll get it fixed. Dad, I'm so sorry. I think I messed up. What happened? I asked Teeny Terry to fix a clog in my bathroom, but I made him do a quick fix, not a forever fix. Don't worry. Teeny Terry and I will get on it right away. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> your teeth? Dr. Anna, I didn't know I had a dentist appointment today. I, um, is that a new lab coat? The fuzzly spotter. Yes, I mean, I'm sorry. I can't have my checkup right now. I understand. Thanks. Come on, Bosley. Yeah! <laughs> Say they have a sore tooth? Jeff Jeff did, not me. Gotta go. It's so wiggly. Bosley wiggle too. <laughs> Are you ready now, Abby? Ah! Help! <gasps> Harriet, I'm sorry. I. I'll find you later. Okay. Come on, Bosley. Abby. Ah! I'm just finishing up with all this, and then it'll be your turn. Quick! No, no, no! Not that one! Ah! Elevator falling! Falling? It's okay. Deploy the parachute. 
parachute, Otis. Oh, yeah. Oh, parachute not working! I see the problem. The parachute lever is missing. Dr. Anna, do you have a toothbrush? <laughs> Bravest girl I've ever met. I might not be that brave. I'm afraid to have you check my wiggly tooth. What wiggly tooth? I only see a missing tooth. What? I can't believe it came out and I didn't even notice. I guess I am pretty brave. Hmm. And I'm brave enough to see the dentist. Uh... Abby's baby toys. What's in this box? <gasps> it's all my old toys. I forgot all about you. You haven't played with them in ages. Maybe we should donate them to charity. But these toys are mine. I don't want to give them away. I want to keep them. Sure, if you'll play with them, that's great. Come on, Bosley. Let's get these toys to my room and start playing. You stack them biggest to smallest. See? Cool. Now what? That's kind of it. Oh, so... Not gonna play with them? We have to, or Mom will say we should give them away. Hmm... Maybe we can play with them a different way. I figured out how to use more of my old toys. Georgie Bunny and I attached the roller skates to the tea tray to make a potato bag roller, like a wagon. Ooh! One, two... two. Ah! Gotcha! Uh-oh! Buzzy, okay? <laughs> Hi, Jeffrey and Lara. Sorry we interrupted your lunch. Abby, are those toddler roller skates? They sure are. I've been looking for skates just like these for Lara. Skates! 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 Really? You like roller skates? <laughs> to do with all my old toys. <laughs> Abby, look! Laura's skating! Skate to Buzzy! I actually think you'd love a lot of my old toys. Wanna see? Ooh! You can keep them all. All for Laura? Hi! Thank you! Abby's perfect sport! I need to find a track and field sport I can do without my fuzzly catching gear. Curly try long jump. Good idea. Here's the start line. <whistles> Curly jump long, long, long. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, Curly. Yeah. Okay, my turn. No gear, just jump. Here I go. <whistles> Pogo spring shoes activate. <gasps> do that. This jump doesn't count. I'm too nervous to long jump without using my pogo spring shoes. Don't give up. Try another track and field sport. How about shot put? Throw ball really far. Go! Be confident, Abby. You can do this. I can't do it. Launch your glove. Activate! Ta-da! I have another pie. Oh. Oh. Sorry about your picnic. It's okay. We kind of lost our appetite. Come on, Jeffrey. Let's go fly our giant kite. Yes! It's no use. I can't do track and field day at all. What do we do? Oh, no. Bosley, look out! We lost control of our kite! Ah! <gasps> Abby! 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 I'm coming! Yeah! Track and field sport? Jumping over things is called hurdles. I just did that without any of my gear. Flying sport! Hurdles are my track and field sport. I'm good at them all by myself. And all of you help me figure it out. Yay! Abby's sleep trouble. Okay, sleepover time. You can have my bed and we'll take the air mattress. Thanks. Nighty night, Melvin. <laughs> How 
can anybody sleep through that, Bosley? I think we're gonna need a new plan. I hope the salon chair is comfy. Nighty night, Abby. Ugh, nighty night. <laughs> I give up. I just wish I had some place to sleep. Come you fuzzies, big and small. Abby needs exponential. She can't sleep and she's so sad. Needs our help, she needs some help. Poor Abby. She tried sleeping near my snug, but it didn't work. There's got to be a way we can help. Hmm. Come on! Surprise! Surprise! <gasps> you made me my very own snug? Sure and you can. You, you Abby. Snug yep. you. Uh -huh. you Fuzzlies are the best friends ever. <laughs> Thanks, Grumbles. <sighs> Wait, don't go. I know I couldn't sleep in any of your snugs, but I'd love a sleepover in mine. Will you stay? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Good night, Fuzzlies. Good, Good night, night, Abby. A hotel talent show was a great idea. Our next performer is Teeny Terry. Think of a talent, think of a talent, think of a talent. Uh, Teeny Terry, is everything okay? I can't do it! <laughs> I still don't have a talent for the show. We're gonna find you one, all of us. Oh, yeah. yeah! You can try singing like Princess Flug. Me, 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 me. Me, me, me. Hmm. Oh. Singing is not my talent. That's okay. Maybe you can play the accordion like Otis. Uh, oh. <laughs> Playing the accordion is not my talent either. Okay, how about a juggling act? Uh, uh. <gasps> myself when no one catches me. All oh, those somersaults and jumps and slides, that's gymnastics. And you're really, really good at it. You mean, <gasps> it's my talent? Ugh. Yes, your talent. The Hotel Talent Show presents Katie Terry. <laughs> <laughs> I got stuck. All I wanted was a cozy little snug of my own, like Princess Flog and Otis. A teeny Terry snug is a great idea, but you should have it on the roof deck where you bird watch. I'd love a snug on the roof deck. Operation Build a Snug is on. To the roof deck. Teeny Terry, welcome to your new snug. Ooh. Which button should I press? Huh? Me build perfect snug me. It is perfect. Perfect for Princess Flug. Step inside your dream snug. <laughs> what's wrong? The snugs are what's wrong. They're nothing like what I wanted. You're right. I'm so sorry, Teeny Terry. <laughs> <gasps> the snugs were all wrong. Uh, maybe I don't need a snug after all. Yes, you do. Just tell us exactly what you want. 
Okay, well, I want this and definitely this. It's spectacular. Let's build. Terry, is it you? Yes, yes! This bug is all me! <laughs> Teeny Terry, our official to-do list. Ready. <clears throat> Fix Miranda's watering can. Add stuffing and repatch the cushion on the lobby couch. And last but not least, paint Abby's bedroom. <laughs> We have a long list of fixing to do. You said it, Teeny Terry. That's why I've got a surprise for you. A new screwdriver for your fix-it helmet. teeny -tastic. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, Lex. Let's put your newest tool to use on to-do list item number one, the watering can. Tool time, Teeny Terry. <laughs> Whoa. Go. And now, before we move on with the to-do list, I've got to get a new roller brush to do Abby's room. <laughs> but it's nothing a quick trip to the hardware store can't fix. Back in a jiffy, Teeny Terry. See ya. Hey, want to check out these colors in my room? I've got to get to work. Lex gave me a gift. Now I want to give him one, too. All back in the cushion. This will be so much quicker. <laughs> Done. Teeny tastic. I sure hope Lex likes what we did. He'll love it. <laughs> <gasps> okay, Teeny Terry, I'm back. Surprise! <laughs> the cushion. It's fixed. There's more. Follow me. You finished the to-do list. What an amazing surprise. It was a gift, and I never would have gotten it done without the help of all my friends. Otis! Elevator shake and buttons pop off! Lex to the rescue! I see the problem. The little wheel's out of place, and now the gears won't work. You'd have to be really small to get into a place that tight. Then it's a good thing you have your super small sidekick, Teeny Terry. Me? Yes! That's a great idea! What if I mess up? You can do this, Teeny Terry. I know you can. Okay, I'm going in. Yay! 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 I can do this. I see it! Fuzz-tastic! Can you get it back in place? I think so. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Oh, no! Oh, I messed up again! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh, no, Abby! Teeny Terry getting big! He can't get big inside the elevator panel. He'll break the whole thing. He can't help it. Every time he tries to fix something, he gets so frustrated.
you can float back home. That's a teeny fantastic <laughs> idea. Here we go. <laughs> it worked! <laughs> Abby, the babies want to stay with me, but they haven't learned how to fly yet. They're not safe up here. Then let's get them down. Pogo Spring Shoes, activate! Tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> We're on it. Good job. Oh, thanks, Grumbles. Now I can go back home. When the moon is super full and bright, we'll see the Fuzzly in the moon. I want to see the Fuzzly in the moon. Oh, here he comes. Look. Yeah. I kind of see the Fuzzly in the moon. If you want to see him better, you'll need this. They're pretend telescopes, but they help. Try it. Oh, I do see him a little better, but I don't want to just see him. I want to fly up and meet him. But what if my wings get tired and I can't make it all the way? Ooh, tube towers! <laughs> That's it! Whoa! Oh, whoa. Oh, I can make a giant tower to the moon. Then I can climb up and not worry about my wings getting tired. Climbing to the moon for thrills. Still keep climbing and you'll soon you'll meet the fuzzy in the moon. One more to glued. Uh oh. Whoa! Phew. Huh? Oh no! Cluster ears! Go! Goo gripper gloves, activate! Good job! Ouch! It's okay, Teeny Terry. I have just the thing in my care case. Here. All better. Thanks, Abby. Huh. But now I'll never get to the Fuzzly in the moon. Hmm. Teeny Terry, we have something for you. You do? What is it? Ta-da! It's a real telescope. <gasps> Check it out. It's the Fuzzly in the moon. I see him. He's so close. Hi, Fuzzly in the moon. Huh? What's happening? What's going on? Chipmunks? I'm 
ready for you to work your magic, Mrs. Melvin. How do you do it? I'll let you in on a little secret. This hairbrush. <gasps> hairbrush. <laughs> I can't wait to try this brush. A little spritz. Now I just need my... It's gone! There's trouble in the salon. We heard there's trouble. Whoa. Wow. I know. I just can't make the styles I want without my special brush. That must be why the fuzzly alarm went off. Zoom or view specs, activate. A clue. Hmm. A pink and yellow hair. <gasps> A new fuzzly. Mrs. Melvin, maybe that's who took your brush. Please find it so I can fix these hair catastrophes. <laughs> We haven't found it yet, but we know how to get it back. We'll get the Fuzzly to come to the salon. Yeah! We'll give her what she loves most. Someone who needs a great hairdo. I volunteer. If we can just talk to the Fuzzly, I know we'll get your brush back. Okay, Mom. Oh, my. I am so sad that I need my hair done. Oh, no. I'm coming. Just a sec. Won't be a moment. Phew. Sorry for the wait. You do need a new hairdo. Ugh. Voila! You're really good at hair. But why did you take Mrs. Melvin's brush? I wanted to be a great hairstylist like Mrs. Melvin. I shouldn't have taken it without asking, though. Can you forgive me? Aww. Aww. My baby! You're closing the salon, but... Only for the day, Harriet. <laughs> what will I do if I can't style hair? Oh, just relax and have fun. But I relax and have fun styling hair. I love everything in the salon. Curling irons and... <gasps> Scissors! <laughs> <gasps> hair flare! What are you doing? I'm styling. Look! Cool! They are cool, but I was writing all my lists on those papers. I'm sorry. It's okay. Why aren't you in the salon? I want to be, but it's close today. I don't know what to do if I can't style. Hmm. Here, try these. Harriet size pruning shears. They are perfect. Hair flare! Ah! Ta-da! Wow! Amazing! I'm always happy when my styling hero, Mrs. Melvin, is around. Oh, that is so sweet. And I am gorgeous. <laughs> Yay, Harriet! What a wonderful way to use your talents. Thanks, Mrs. Melvin. But my favorite thing is styling hair in our salon. I'm glad to hear that. But the salon won't be open again until tomorrow morning, so you can enjoy the rest of your day off. But what would I do with myself? <gasps> I know. Oh, this is the best idea ever. Who knew relaxing could be fun? <laughs> Are you all going to watch me learn to dance? Nope. The peepers can't see you. They're wearing salon masks. Can't see, can't see, can't see, because we're wearing masks. I'll see you, but I'm the only one. You won't be scared around me, right? Right. Okay, peepers, hit the disco music. Go, Harry, go. Swing that disco pony. Here we go. And a one, and a two, and a three. One, two, three. You're getting the moves, and you look fantastic. I'm starting to feel great. I love your hair. But if you want to try something new, I could work some magic. Huh? Okay, swing! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Harriet? <gasps> you saw me? I'm so embarrassed. I gotta go. <gasps> this is terrible. I'm never going to dance again. But Harriet, you love dancing. We gotta find a way to help her, Bosley. 
It's not much now, but with some colored lights, it'll be the most dance-tacular disco ever!
teacher, right, Poe? Just like me. That, Babe Abby, is the greatest compliment you could 